Welcome to Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis. Today, controversial subject. Equal pay for both men and women. Stay tuned. All right, guys, so controversial topic today. I know we finally got to the ground where in all tournaments, men or women get equal pay. I totally respect that. And I totally think that it's long in coming and well-deserved for the women now, right? I. I've been Absolutely. talking about this for years. You've been talking about this for years, right? We all put in the same time and the effort, um, two out of three sets, and I, you know, it, it's about time. You know, is what I've I've said, and you guys, I'm sure, agree with me. But there's also a gray merit, a gray area in the matter, and it really only comes into play when we talk about the grand slams now it is equal pay in the grand slams um australian wimbledon french u.s open but but the men go three out of five sets the women go two out of three sets now coach rob you're you're my switzerland here um should you get equal pay if you're playing less and a woman? Well, that's a good question there, Harry. <laughs> I look at it this way. There's when the women play at two out of three and there's a great woman's two out of three set match. I'd love to see them keep playing. Like, I don't want it to be over. I'd love to see them go longer. Um, but at the same time, you know, that is the way it is. And, um, you know, I, I get it. But, I, I but agree there's... with you. If there's a great women's match, I would love to see it go longer too. But the question is, do they want to see it go longer on the court? Well, that I can't answer. <laughs> but I, you know, I do know that they're such good athletes. Totally. They're, 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 it's full commitment to training. Mm -hmm. And, um, you know, you'd love to see somebody get down two sets and find a way to come back. And, you know, Andy Murray just played – uh, a couple amazing five setters, right? And even really long two out of threes, right? And you you love the fact that they are able to, you know, drop two sets and and find a way to come back. And it's just right. a different, um, you know, if you lose a first set, you're not like fairly cooked. You you can um, keep working and keep fighting, and you never know what's going to happen. Right. So that's what I'm saying. This is very controversial because if you're wanting equal pay should you make the women play more or let's look at it from the other side what about and, and it's been talked about having the men play two out of three that yeah i mean i personally don't have five hours to sit there and watch a slam final i mean okay if it's fed was in it i'd find a way but not everybody has that much time right to invest in one match mm -hmm, mm -hmm. um so you know, uh, that's another w way of you're going to limit less injuries. You're, you know, people obviously have less attention spans now, but right. Um, but that's tradition. That like, is tradition for sure. Like only in the slams do you go three out of five. Right. No, nothing else in right. any other tournament do you go three out of five. Right. Well, look at the history of Wimbledon with. Isner and Mahout. I don't right. can't remember the year, but it was right. what 70, 68? Right, right. I don't right. know if that's exactly the score. If somebody can fact check that, but it was pretty close. I mean, right. that thing went for three days. Right. Like right. that was historical. Like that was unbelievable. And, and won't happen again. No, because they changed the rules. <laughs> right. But to figure Mahout, I think had to hold serve, like he was facing elimination for like two days, mm -hmm, and he mm -hmm. kept holding serve. Right. Right. So. You know, that's the gray area where I guess people don't really talk about, though. That, that's what I'm a little bit surprised at is I, I understand the equal pay thing. Um, I know that there has been talks of the men going 
to two out of three, but they never talk about women going three out of five. Now, was there a time, and I could be wrong, I thought it was like, was it the end of the year um, uh, women's tournament where they did go three out of five years ago? I don't recall I, that I, I could be wrong, but I thought there was one tournament, like the last one before the break. Huh. Um, somebody have to look that yeah, up. Yeah, guys, if I, you I, it, know that one, let us know. I kind of thought I remember that, but that was years ago, so I, I don't know. Hmm. I, I don't remember that, but I, I maybe I'll look that one up. If guys, if you know about that one, let us know. Um, I don't. And remember. I could be wrong. I just. <laughs> I don't remember women ever going three out of five. That was like the only time. And I, like I said, I could be wrong, but I kind of thought there was some, okay. you know, because they figured it was the end of the year, they had a break, and these were the two best players going at it. And right. so, the, you know, they wanted to see more tennis. Right. So that brings us to a different subject, too. Um, do we really want to see uh, a faster match? If we go two out of three in the men's, that makes – it end faster at, you know, without a uh, Isner Mahout kind of a ending. So would you want to see a shorter match automatically go two out of three then? I, you know, it, in a it, slam, in a slam, that's, you know, the slam's different because you have that day off mm -hmm. and it's two weeks. And right. that is part of the, the whole slam experience of you're going to play a longer match, but you, you get a day off in between. Mm -hmm. So, but the women get a day off too. Correct. So maybe they can go three out of five too. I, <laughs> you know, I know there are matches where I'd be like, oh, I wish they were still playing. If I were the woman, maybe I'd be going, you know, two out of three is good. Right. But they're such good athletes and they're such totally. phenomenal players that, um, you know, Yep. There's times where you want to see more, let's, just as a fan. Let's take it to the people here. Guys, what do you think? Um, do you think it matters, for one? You know, does, is it okay for the women to go two out of three, the men go three out of five and earn the same? Do you think it's too much for the men and we should go two out of three? Um, or do you actually think that the women should go three out of five? And I'm only talking about in those four majors, in the Grand Slams only, okay? Let me know in the comments what you think. I will be looking at this one, and we may do a follow-up to this just to see what my tennis enthusiasts think, okay? Because, I mean, I don't really have an opinion one way or another. I just think that you know equal pay you know one way or another could be could be evened out a bit more right does that make sense yeah no i i you know i didn't really have an opinion either but just as we were standing here talking it thinking about it right you know there's pros and cons to both and you know obviously people play longer risk of injuries greater mm -hmm. you don't want to see anybody getting hurt because that puts them out longer but right right right, right. um all right yeah so to be continued, guys, all right, let me know, guys. Uh, Coach Rob, thank you sure. for uh, the minor debate, I guess we can call it. <laughs> there we <laughs> the go. The gentleman's debate. Yes. All right. Guys, thank you for watching Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis. Coach Rob, it's a little cold. I'm freezing, Harry. Keep moving your feet. <laughs> <laughs> and it's dark. Ooh, I can't then, barely see. Then you better not miss, Harry, because then you're going to get colder. <laughs> Here we go. Ooh. Ooh, gosh. All right. Do you want that, pro? That will make you play in the dark, make you play in the freezing cold, not let you give up on your tennis. Well, I got my coach, Rob. You can get your coach, Rob, at play your court. You can find over 27,000 players out there, coaches and playing partners, all at playyourcourt.com.